Hello everyone, this is Rex from Shredders Gaming here with a game called Portal. Now this is like Portal 2, except the first one. Yeah. So uh, this is the first Portal, the one that started the series of two. As you know, Valve has a lot of trouble counting to three. Um, but yes, yeah, so this is Portal 1 I want to go through and play through for you guys. Uh, I guess we're going to test chamber 00, zero chapter 1. Uh, is there more options? Oh, more levels. That one. Start new game. Loading. That's some pretty sweet music. Okay. I can dig this. Uh, it's Wasad. Oh, look, Wasad! Woo! Wasad! Yay! Don't teach me controls. Just let me go! I'm a fish. So you gotta remember this radio station though, 85-2, that- Oh look, it's me! Hi! Aren't you a beautiful person? Okay, I'm gonna go over here. Looks pretty safe. I'll- Is this gonna start out like way easier than the other one? E to pick up an object! This is my kind of puzzle! Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material emancipation grid will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Okay. Now this started off. This start. This is starting me off uh, way easier than the other one. Much nicer place, uh, it's not destroyed, like what they did to it. Fuck. Looks like we're stuck. Okay, no, okay, I thought we were getting stuck. No, we're fine. Alright, cool. That elevator was just shady as fuck. Test one. Oh, god. Alright, I guess, uh, easy mode's gone. Um... So, how's everyone's day? Place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt aperture science heavy duty super colliding super button. The super colliding super button. I'm stuck in this room. Thank you. Oh, okay, so it's on a rotation and I'm just crazy. I don't want to go there right now. There we go. Now let's put it on the super button. Perfect. Please move quickly to the chamber lock as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. Is there something I can get from being exposed to that button or are you just fucking with me? Alright GLaDOS, you're pretty cool! Oh god, why is this elevator shake? I don't like this elevator very much, GLaDOS. It's like being trapped in a little box. I like the clear one better. Loading. Loaded! You're doing very well. Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. Okay. So now what? Hey, friend. Am I supposed to be down here? Very good. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. 
With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should move. I like this device already! It comes with a warning! I want to stare directly into the light of this. I need a mirror, so I can stare at it. See if my head explodes or something. That'd be interesting, wouldn't it? Well, that'd be a weird way to start with the death of the main character. I feel like GLaDOS is a little more sarcastic in this one. I like, uh, the other GLaDOS better. The one, that, the one that was actively trying to kill me and stuff. That GLaDOS was way more fun. Cause she was a sarca- well Remember, the aperture science bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. Tested for what? I don't know. I don't think I want to know. I don't know. I kind of like Freelance GLaDOS better when she was, uh... Oh, when she was all like, I'm gonna- you, you killed me. I'm gonna kill you back. And yeah. And then there was Wheatley and everyone and, you know. Welcome to test chamber four. You're doing quite well. So I can only place blue portals. I'll place it on the ground. Whoa! Once again, excellent work. As part of a required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Wait, why aren't you monitoring the next test chamber? What's... is it... you said protocol? What kind of weird fucked up protocol is this? Oh shit. No, that's a light. Damn it. I wanted to go up there. These elevators are boring. The other ones were exciting because you didn't know if they were gonna crash. This one's just solid and works. Ugh. Efficiency. God, why? This is so totally monitored. Alright, it looks like Cube's gonna hit me in the side of the face. Bonk. Bonk. What happens if I do the other one? Cool. There's one more thing I have to do before I leave this test chamber since I'm not monitored. Darn. That didn't work as I wanted it to. Oh, what the As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. All right, that was crazy. That was fun. Um, I'm glad they weren't monitoring me that, because I did some weird things in there. Uh, they weren't watching me. But, I mean, they did watch me, but, like, uh, I didn't know they were watching me. And now I'm glad they watched me. Loading. Nailed it. What the fuck is this? Safety is one of many enrichment center goals. The aperture science high energy pellet seen to the left of the chamber can and has caused permanent disabilities such as vaporization. Please be careful. Unbelievable. You. Subject name here. Must be the pride of. Subject hometown here. So that causes vaporization. Yeah. So moon walk into this elevator. Cause yeah. We don't need to go forwards in elevators. Oh god, why? Whoa, what is that? Is that how fast we're going up? We're going up really fast. 
I wonder how it feels to go up in an elevator that fast. Devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to edge it. Good. Now use the aperture science on stationary scaffold to reach the chamber lock. That looks dangerous. It also looks very boringly slow. Uh, we're gonna go on killing spree here. This thing. Whee! This elevator has a pretty rocky start. Loading. Alright, well I think I'm going to leave this episode here. As always, like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And until next time, it's been Rex, signing off. Later, guys.